G'day Komatsu Western Region, I'm Coram Ellis from Audiocom and today I'm going to show you the preferred installation method of the Cellfy Mobile Go Repeater and GME Mobile Antenna to the Toyota Hilux Komatsu vehicles. Start by installing the antenna mounting bracket. Fasten it tightly with the included stainless steel screws and nylock nuts. Secure it with a galvanized self-drilling screw to prevent rotation. Feed the antenna cable of the GM antenna through the bracket and fasten the retaining nut. Fit protective split loom tubing across the antenna cable to protect against weathering and unwanted contact in transit. Now carefully run the antenna cable through the front grille and under the bonnet, keeping it clear of hot surfaces and any moving parts. Using a feeding tool, breach the firewall grommet and feed the tool through. Firmly tape and protect the end of the GME antenna cable to the feeder tool. Use some silicon braced lubrication and feed the tool through the firewall grommet. Cable tie excess cable firmly into place so that it can't move freely around the engine bay. Secure the cable in all areas so that it can't move around loosely on the vehicle. Now to install the self I go proper. Remove the glove box from the Toyota Hilux. Start by first locating and fastening the internal antenna for the Cellfigo mobile repeater. Run the cable in parallel with factory cable looms 
through to the left side of the glove box area. Thoroughly clean the surface to adhere the internal antenna. Use wax and grease remover or a similar gentle solvent to prepare the surface. Stick the internal antenna into place. Secure the cable firmly along the cable run to prevent the cable moving freely about the cabin. Prepare the power cable for the self go. Cut the power cable to 40 centimeters and bear back the two ends ready for direct manual connection to the car. The side with the writing or the trace is the negative. Firmly crimp an eye terminal for the ground connection to this negative cable. Firmly crimp a fuse tap to the positive cable for positive power connection for the self ICO mobile repeater. Fit a 10 amp fuse to the fuse tap and fit into this position of the factory fuse panel to the left of the glove box area. Now fasten the ground eye terminal to the body of the vehicle. You'll find a 10mm nut attached to the chassis just above the glove box area. Undo this nut, fit the eye terminal over the bolt, and refasten the nut. Fasten all cables securely and neatly with cable ties. So as not to misplace it later, cable tie the fuse panel cover to the wiring loom in front of the fuse panel for easy reference in the future. Now it's time to connect the self go mobile repeater. Attach the ground loop wire to the body of the self -ide. Now attach the antennas. Pay attention to the icon at the end of each cell, uh, at the each end of the cell fire, which indicates which antenna connect to connect.
Now power up the Cellfi by connecting the power connector. It will start a self-diagnosis process. There is a great position behind the glove box in the Toyota Hilux, which accommodates the body of the Cellfi nicely. Slide it into this position, bundle up excess, cable uh, excess cables and fasten them with a cable tie. Then fasten the Cellfi body with cable ties to existing large factory rooms to keep it secure and stop it from rattling or moving during transit. Wave app with your mobile device. Connect to the Cellfi, fill out the appropriate activation information, and check the boost and connection level of the Cellfi in the Cellfi Wave app. The app will indicate any changes that need to be made if it's not in an optimal configuration. Now refit the glove box, clear any excess materials from. 